welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new. So today I'm showing you how to make this card. So I'm taking a 6x4 inch card base, the Cinnamon with a Sunflower by CC Designs. And I'm only going to be using the Sentiment, the Happy Autumn. And then I'm taking the Autumn Tree by Autumn Blessings, which is a crafter's companion. And the best thing about this is everything is labeled with numbers. And it also gives you four inks to use with it. But obviously I wanted to use some Distress Oxides. So I'm using mustard seed, vintage photo, ripe prisms or preserves or whatever it's called, and crackling campfire. So this card is actually in a collaboration with another girl over on Instagram. So we decided to do a card to bring in the autumn months. So when this video goes up, it is officially the start of autumn and Quite frankly, that is my time of year. I absolutely love autumn and winter. They're my favorite months, like, but everybody else is like probably really unhappy about it and wants summer and spring and stuff to be back. Autumn and winter are just basically my type of weather because obviously I am a natural redhead, so I do struggle with heat. Um, also, sometimes it can just get too hot. I and mean, obviously in the UK, we're not exactly equipped for it, so it's just mixed hit things so much harder i find sleeping a lot harder as well so i don't have as much energy and yeah honestly so for autumn and winter it's just so much easier because you know it's easier to warm up than what it is to cool down i find so anyways so as you can see i just did my tree um the first one i did i didn't actually line it up with anything i just winged it and the second one i kind of did i did two pencil marks on where the corner of the stamps needed to be. As you can see, I have stamped out the images. So the images are actually from Fall Friends by My Favourite Things, and I've just masked them. Also, I keep getting questions about the tattoo on my arm. It isn't real, it is a temporary tattoo. You know, I got it um, because obviously, you know, I've always wanted a tattoo, I just never really knew what I wanted, and this is a great way of me to figure out what I like and what works best for me, but I'm very undecisive and quite frankly, I change my mind. So yeah, I don't think I'm ever gonna get a tattoo, but as you can see, I've just worked out some markings using the Drift and Hill stencil and I'm bringing in Peanut Brittle, which is a memento ink um, because I just wanted something a bit darker and to represent like the crusty leaves and you know, like the dried out hillsides that you see. So yeah. I also did bring in another Distress ink for the sky, which was Tattered Rose. So I'm going to insert some music because once I've done this, I just coloured up my images. Um, so yeah, I will talk to you guys closer to the end when I start to add final details. finished everything and bringing in the sentiment which I said was from the cinnamon and sunflower set um, and I'm using espresso oh my god I think it's espresso truffle I think it will be linked in my description yeah espresso truffle but that is it for the video guys I did add some Lade pearls in from pretty pink posh and I also added wink of Stella just to add some sparkle into the background but quite frankly, I love how this turned out. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you like and subscribe. Follow me over on my social medias and check out the other girls card. It will be linked over on my Instagram. So I will see you guys in my next video. Stay safe and happy crafting. Bye guys.